Welcome back to Everyday Kentucky. We are here with our Jason Lindsay, who's who's cooking aluminum cans right now. But why, India? Don't don't ask me. I've been backing up slowly. <laughs> <laughs> Jason, what is happening with today's experiment? It has to do with weather, actually. Air pressure, you know, high pressure, low pressure. We are creating a low pressure inside of our can, and we're getting ready to crush a can with ice water. So what you do is you put a little bit of water in an old soda pop can. Once you see the cloud come out, you're going to turn it upside down, and then we'll sit there and let that one boil a little bit longer and make sure we get that going. We're going to pour that out and put this one back on here and let it start all over. We're going to give that just a few more seconds. And while we're waiting on that, I have a balloon here and I want India to take this balloon. Okay. And I want you to hold it above the candle and get it close to the flame. What do you think might happen <laughs> as we're waiting on that yeah. experiment to cook up? Not yet though. Okay. So first and foremost, kids do not eat or drink your science experiment. Have an adult around, wear the appropriate safety gear. Flame, we got a fire extinguisher here in case if you catch yes. on fire. What? Yes. What's going to happen yes. if you <laughs> place that balloon in the flame. Oh, I'm going to get scared. Is there anything in there? Shake no. it around. Air. Air. It's all about matter, which is anything that takes up space and has mass. Okay. We have a gas on the inside. It's not a smelly gas. Right. Jim pass a lot of gas. <laughs> Absolutely. Oh, he of course. does. That's why of we, we burned the candle. Okay. Go ahead. Put it on there. Let's see what happens. On or in over the, it? In the flame. In the flame. Oh, I'm so scared. I'm so scared. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Okay. He <laughs> got okay. me. Yeah. I know, right? I knew there was some on me So somewhere. we put the actual candle out, so we'll let Jim ignite that again. Okay. And then we have another balloon over here. This is a very special balloon because it has something inside of it. Go ahead and pick that balloon up, Jim, and shake it around. <gasps> shake oh, it around. Oh, it's got oh, water. It has this water. It's got water, yeah. You can hear it right there. Okay. Is it going to explode? <laughs> I, I hope so. I mean, that would give me pleasure. <laughs> pleasure. Okay, so here's the deal. The Earth has a lot of oceans on it. Right. If it wasn't for the oceans absorbing the heat from the warming Earth, it would be 10 times hotter. Right. So thank you, oceans. We're going to prove that. Hopefully, wait a minute, is that real wood? Not yes. on wood. <laughs> uh, he's going to put the flame where the water is. The water will actually boil if we wait long enough okay. in the balloon before it pops. Uh, let me step back just in case. Sometimes Same. science experiments uh, don't always because work. Because I have. <laughs> Why is it me? Why not Go ahead, India? Get a little closer, a little closer, a closer, little closer, 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 closer. Is it popping? No. Nope. No. No. Nope. Not at all. Oh wow! That water <laughs> is actually absorbing the heat from the candle burning there and not popping. Thank you, oceans, for making it cooler on Earth. I know, right? I just was hoping it would blow. Now, isn't that pretty awesome? What's well, scorched on the bottom? It you, did. You, so you we know the flame is oh, there. The flame wow. Is there. We'll go ahead and see that. blow this out so we don't put our arm in it and catch on fire. No, we don't uh, want that. Set them back on there. We have our two cans over here. The water on the inside is super hot. Okay. This one over here, remember, we tried earlier and it didn't work. Yeah. You know, science has to have a certain thing. The ingredients have to come together, like weather. The ingredients have to come together, and if they don't, then we don't get the weather results. So hopefully this one will be ready as we're patiently waiting on this one. I'm going to try to use this so I don't burn my hand at all. And then I'll, oh, look, it started now. It's about ready. Oh, yeah. Now I'm going to take this one and turn it upside down. Oh, it's not that hot. Did oh, you see that? Jason, wow. That I was quick. We crushed that can just like that, all because a low pressure system formed on the inside of the can. We had higher pressure on the outside. We put a little bit of water inside of that soda pop can. It started to boil, so we got to at least 212 or above that, and then we created that low pressure, turned it upside down. The air on the outside was stronger. It compressed and crushed that can. Now, Jim just crushes them on his head, right? Absolutely. That's right. You do too? No. <laughs> no. no. Not at all. You think this one's good to go? I'm mm. not sure. So, Jason, if mm -hmm. there was no water in there, would it still crush? It would not. Okay. You need that water in there. That water is going to help create that low pressure system. Low pressure is red on a weather map. Let's see if you really pay attention to Jim's forecast. Okay. Mm. What color is an H on the weather map? A low pressure is red. I don't think she paid any attention. She doesn't pay I do traffic. What color is? It's red. What, it's it's red. Uh, is what it color? True? Maroon. True red. What what is that? Burgundy. Red, red is <laughs> red is an L. Oh, blue uh, is an H. Think of UK awesome team, high pressure, strong ah. top. Yes. Ooh. Color blue, got it? Okay. So high pressure on the outside. You think this one's ready here? Yeah. Right, so let's do it because we're about to run out of okay. time. Upside down. And oh, oh, it did it. It did it. Yes, we crushed that can too. So no longer you have to crush cans on your head. You can use science. Thanks Jesus. so much, Jason. You're welcome. We'll make sure to check you out. Hooked on science, right? Mm -hmm. Five for science. Oh yeah. That's right. <laughs> <laughs> we appreciate you so much.